Hello everyone, Sports Center Management app will help in managing the Sports Center as well as the club. After installing this module, now let's get into the Center Sports Management. Here in this dashboard, you can see a new inquiry, students, total trainees, sports activities, grounds, available events, bookings, administration registrations and also you can see a total equipment that we have. Now here under the admission you can see end registrations where you can see all the students registrations from the website and also user can create a new registrations from here. Okay and also you can see all the students details. You can see all the inquiries from the website page. Here you can see all the bookings we have created. Here in the sports tab you can see the trainers and also you can see the events that we have created. Okay. And here in this maintenance, you can see all the equipment and under the configuration tab, you can see the center sports and also you can see the center space. Okay. And here you can see the certificates that we have created. Now, here you can see the registrations. Now, let's see how it actually works from the website page. So for that, let's get into the website. And here, when you get into that, you can see the inquiry page okay so here we need to give all the details about the student so as i am a student i'm going to give the first name last name email mobile okay and on which sports i need to be uh, need an inquiry for that we need to select in sports here and we need to give the duration in days okay so for how many days it worth and what is the inquiry that you have that so we can add that right away here now let's fill all the informations so here you can see that I have filled all the information like first name, last name, email ID, mobile number and here I have selected the sports and also the duration. So here we can give the inquiry detail. Okay. So now once it is done, now let's send this to the backend page. You can see the thank you message. Now let's get into the backend. So from here, let's get into the center sports management where you can see the inquiry. So let's get into the inquiry one okay so here uh, this is the one which we have created so here you can see the description about it and if needed you can just send an answer by using this template so it will send a mail to the user which we have selected and also to the email which we have entered here okay and here you can see the admission so once everything is done you can just click on the admission so it will be in the registration tab now okay you can see that person will be available in the registration tab now we can just enroll it okay and here we can just create an invoice so for that we need to select end trainer here okay now let's create an invoice so let's get into that so here you can see that for the cricket it worth of for the five quantity it worth of five price and also you can see the subtotal about it you can just make a payment right away here and for each and every uh, student admission, you can see the invoice and also you can see the stages will be in the enrolled state. Now let's make a student. So this will be this person will be uh, now available in the student category. So you can see that the student admission will be in the student state now. Okay. And also you can see a cancel state is also available. In the list view, we can see the name, student name, mobile, email, on which sports that student uh, login it and also the level trainer and as well as the status of it now we can see the same student will be available in the students now okay so this will be the student and here you can see all the details about them so we know about and registration students and also the inquiries we can just register by uh, using the online portal so let's get into that so here you can see the registration so from here user can just make an registration from here it's name of that user okay and here we can just add an ground and we need to give the date so according to the date it will take and time spent and also you can just uh, create a description if needed one and you can just make a payment from here so it will be taking that football ground so for this we can make a booking from here so this is how we can make a booking and here you can see the hours now so based on the hours it will take the unit price okay the quantity so based on the uh, unit price it will take an amount from here now in each and every booking we can see the sales order that we have created based on the hours of unit uh, quantity that we have spent 
now you can just confirm the order you can see that it the booking will be in the confirmed state now so from here you can see the status of it in the list view so here from the sports you can see the trainers these are the trainers which we have created and here you can see the events that we have created and here you can see these are the events which are created and these events are available on the website page so here in this website page you can see the events where you can see uh, this event will be already registered so let's get into the cricket one so here you can see the register option and you can see and quantity amount will be there okay now let's click on the register and let's continue that process of doing the payment now the payment will be done okay now let's get into the back end and here you can see that let's refresh this page here you can see one attendee will be there and you can see the sales amount so where you can see the customer will be here okay and here you can see the attendees so whether it is confirmed or not you can just see an attendee details so here in this page now when you get into the event you can see that it will be in the registered state now so in this way portal user can easily register the event which we have created and here in this equipment we can just create an equipment okay and here you can see that we have created and send us sports in the space as well as the certificates so for certificates we we need to add the content and here we need to add the title name date user type as well as the description and once you click on the certificate you can see the certificate will be available here so in this way we can make use of this module to help in managing the sports center if you have any queries regarding this video you can ask in the comment box we will definitely solve your queries and if you feel this video is helpful to you you can like this video and subscribe our youtube channel for more odoo related updates thanks for watching